We are at a vintage shop here in Paris. It's called Ejerie. And I promised you guys I would take you to some vintage stores. So they've got clothing here. They've got so many vintage Chanel jackets. They've got tons of Chanel, Hermes. So I'm gonna share this all with you guys. I think I wanna start on the other wall with some Chanel bags. And then I'm gonna take you back over to these Hermes, Kelly's and Birkins. Over here, we've got so many great Chanel bags. Paris is a great place to buy vintage handbags. Price points are so much better than anywhere, anywhere. This is a 1994, 1996 deep chocolate brown. In those years, Chanel was doing a lot of these very dark brown colors. And this has the plated 24 karat real gold. So this is such a gorgeous piece. And then this over here is a Diana bag. This one here is 6,400 euros. I always love the Diana bag. And then over here, we've got a little bit of Hermes. We've got a gorgeous croc. This is in the 32 size. And let me see what year it's from. Kelly 32 Cellier. It doesn't have the year, but it's a really good price point for croc. We've got this beautiful boy bag. This is in the new medium size. It's kind of got the aged calf skin. And then over here, now I can't tell if this is a 25 or a 28, but I think it's a 28. Let's see, I love this red color. It's a box calf. So it's from 1998. And does it have the year? It is a size 28. Um, yeah, so it's a size Kelly 28 Hermes from 1998. That one is stunning. And now this one here is called a hack, H-A-C, I believe. It, Cause this one's really big. I've actually never seen one this size. I'm gonna ask them, what size H-A-C 50? So this, as, so it is an H-A-C and as you can see, it's got shorter handles. So you can't really, well, you mean you could, but the Birkin has comparative to the size, bigger handles. And yeah, wow, 50 size. This looks like it's almost Berenia leather, so it hasn't been treated. Let's see, 1996. What a piece, and these amazing trunks over here. These are from Celine. Wow, I've never seen Celine trunks before. That is beautiful. And then we've got bunch of gorgeous Hermes bags over here. Okay, so we've got the Kelly 32 Incilier, black, gold hardware. What a beautiful piece. And then behind it, let me just move this. We've got a brown, this is again 32 box cap. I love this deep brown color, 1988. And wow, that is gorgeous. This one here is in pristine condition. I don't even see any hairline scratches on this one from 1999. So Birkin 35 in kind of like a purpley brown color. It's gorgeous. This is the Kelly 32 in Rouge H. Love Rouge H. They've recently brought that color back and um, I just love it. And in box calf, I like how it's more of a deeper, deeper red. It's a really good price. And Kelly 32 box noir, stunning. And then this over here, this is the Kelly 30, I do believe. Yep, and it's in color, oh, so it's in tad collect leather, which is very similar to box calf. And it's in blue electric, it's from 2019, so it's fairly new. And love that one. And we've got some Constances over here. I believe this is in Cre. I could be wrong though. It's in a smooth leather. It looks like Swift. They've got these little mini Lady Dior's, which I love. And then over here, this must be a vintage Constance. Um, or actually, I think that's a size 24. I'm, I'm not 100% sure. And then these are the 18 sizes, so they're a little bit smaller. And this is in Rose Japur. So, so pretty. And then I definitely want to go over some of the jewelry. They've got some great pieces over here. Look at these gorgeous brooches. These are so pretty. I love this one over here. Really nice. And then same with these. 
These are some Chanel vintage necklaces. These are so nice. So if you guys didn't know, well, I'm trying, every time I come to Paris, I always try to get an appointment at Hermes. So far, no appointment. But you know what? Maybe, and maybe we should all do this. Maybe we should just pick up a vintage Hermes Kelly or Birkin because in Paris, like stores like this, you won't find them in any other country. And the price points and just like the quality, like how well kept all these bags are. I see almost no hairline scratches on this one or the other one that I showed you before. This one here. So yeah, this red one I really love. It's stunning, I might try that one on. This is another HAC. So I think this is the 40 size could be a little bit larger than that. This over here is a Birkin, so you can kind of see the HAC versus the Birkin. Let's look at this cute little vintage Chanel piece. It's a Kelly wallet in a tube. They have a lot of Chanel jackets. This sweater, I love this one. This, this is that denim on here. The buttons are so pretty. They look very vintage, those buttons. And this is, this is a vintage Chanel, 3,300 euros. And this one over here, look at the structure in the back, but then in the front, I just love the shape of this. And it's got these three buttons, the little CCs. What a great piece. This is funny, because this just looks so contemporary and modern, yet it's vintage. The buttons with the little camellias. I love this. This coat over here is great. Love that. Okay, I just hung up this coat so you can see it a little bit better. Look at those buttons. And then it cinches in in the center. Such a great piece. Okay, and something that I thought was really interesting. So at first glance, I thought this was a cellier, but this is Retourne and they, it's in box. So it's still very, very structured. Um, you have to be so careful with vintage bags, so I don't really want to handle them too much, but I mean, that's amazing because usually, you know, normally Retourne is in Togos and softer leathers like Swift and they become very slouchy. Um, but this one, because it's in box, it's amazing. That's beautiful. And then this is the exact same bag, same size, but this is in the Cellier version. And you can see them both together. That's amazing. Yeah, I've never seen the Retourne in box hard leather. That looks great. So over here, I have the Rouge H1. And again, earlier I said this was in Cellier because it looks like it is to me, but when you turn it around, now I can see this is in Retourne. And it's because it's that beautiful box calf, it just makes it still so structured, even though it's the Retourne version. I, before seeing this, I didn't even think of getting a Retourne one vintage, right? Because I definitely prefer the Cellier because of the structure. But this is amazing. This is so good. And because it is the Retourne version, it looks a little bit smaller, because this is a size 32. Um, but it looks a lot smaller than, let's say, the Cellier version. That looks so good. Now, this one does not come with a strap because they didn't have straps when this one was uh, made. And as you can see, it does not have the D-rings on it. That is why this one does not have a strap. The color of this one is beautiful. And as you can see, the hardware here Perfect, 1987, such a stunning piece. Love that one. This one here is very 80s. It reminds me of the 80s with the chunky gold. This is, oh, I was right, 86, 88, 5,500. This one here must be vintage, it's like a suede. It doesn't have the year on it. There's a sac de jour from Saint Laurent. I just left Egerie. Sorry if I mispronounce, mispronounce things. So this vintage shop, so cool. I'm excited. I'm gonna take you to another vintage shop now, but I wanted to show you the outside place. They were so nice in there. Um, yeah, there was both the owners were in there. Nicest people ever. 
love this reissue. So this is a Chanel reissue. Gorgeous cream color, and this has the antique gold hardware. This is another HAC. This is in the 50 size. Beautiful Chanel jacket, and then this Dior bag. Look at the charms on that. Love those little charms. We are gonna enter the next vintage shop. This is called Valois Vintage. And let's head in. Oh my god, there's a cute little puppy inside. Puppy. Oh my gosh, I just love you. I miss my dog so much. <laughs> so we are inside Valois now, and again, they're so amazing here and kind. The owner is in this store as well. And this over here is a beautiful kelly 28 return it's kind of more of like a, almost like a stiffer leather this is uh, obviously a vintage leather very similar to epsom so again it keeps its structure because if this was togo it would not have kept the structure so well and again because it is vintage it doesn't have the strap but of course you could put a strap on um and this one does it say the year 1985 so this is from 1985 such a beautiful color wow that is so pretty i love the gold color this one is so nice and look at all this amazing jewelry pieces beautiful now i see some chanel over there that i'm going to share with you because they have so much chanel here they have so much of everything here so definitely recommend this place look at this beautiful chanel classic flap and these are all vintage so this again it's plated in real 24 karat gold look at this unique one over here They've got this Gabrielle bag. So again, the store had just have a little mix of some newer bags because the Gabrielle is a little bit newer. This over here is a seasonal bag. It looks like it's a single flap, but I believe it's a little bit bigger than a jumbo. I could be wrong, but it looks bigger than a jumbo, even though it's just the single flap. Um, then over here, we've got the boy bag love this one so sparkly and then this one is kind of made out of a wool material it's beautiful we've got some Hermes pieces over here the Constance wallet we've got this one now Chanel recently like just this other collection that they just had came out with this exact bag but this one is a lot older but it, it just goes to show you because I know Virginie the new creative director of director of Chanel she's has spoken about you know going back into the archives um and choosing pieces from you know the 80s and the 90s so it's amazing that this bag here they've reintroduced and it's almost identical the new version one i showed it in one of my um chanel shopping vlogs in new york so i'll try to link that above um but yeah this one over here it's beautiful Lots of black, which I love. I'm always a big fan. I love black jacket. And then over here, we've got some Dior. Look at these little mini Dior bags. They're so cute. And then look at this trench from Chanel. This is incredible with the patent leather. So a size 42. Does it say the year? Really pretty love that one and then this lemon yellow bag over here so this bag is unique it's double-sided right no. no what what is this one it's so unique this one is unique because most of the time when you wear a bag we oui. you wear it like this right but this one you wear it like that oh oh wow like i that. see that is so neat. I love the lemon. A, a bucket. Uh, we bucket bag. Like a bucket bag. Yeah. Oh. And when you open, you can open it. Okay. Just like a classic flap. And you have a bucket. Oh, that's so you put your phone there. Exactly. Here. That is really cool. Love that. Thanks for showing me that. I've got an HAC here. This is, I believe, in the 50 size. Mm -hmm. This isn't this. What? Who makes this? Is 
uh, Hermes HSC, this one. But it has somebody's initials yes. there. And it's 50, you said? 50. 50, yeah. I wasn't, I thought it was that, but then I was taken aback when I saw the initials and when I saw the hardware, it's very different, the hardware. Yes, a lot, because uh, this is the difference between the Birkin and the HAC. Mm -hmm. HAC is O A Courroy. Okay. But in English, we say HAC. Yeah. Uh, this one is a vintage one. And it's a 50 size. Yeah. What a piece yes. amazing i'm gonna show you guys some of these black vintage chanel bags this one is beautiful let's see how much this one here is 6300 euros we've got a maxi over there and then they have a diana bag oh wow that is so pretty let me just show yeah the diana is amazing it's such a great piece. For every day, it's a perfect bag too. Mm -hmm. For the one who loves to be cross body. Because mm -hmm. it's a longer strap. It's a long strap. And the size is almost the same as a medium one. Mm -hmm. But it's a little bit taller. Mm -hmm. It's nothing, it's just like one or two centimeters. Mm -hmm. But when the length is 25, the same, but taller. One of two centimeters each inch, everything. It does, right? It makes such a difference. The pearl piece, this one is really nice. This one could be like the wallet on chain or clutch. Yeah. And then the velvet is beautiful. I like the star detail on that one. But what are one, some of your favorite ones? What are your favorite ones? I don't know. The star, this one, it's different. It's a different model. Mm -hmm. This one is from the collection Métier d'Art, Paris Dallas. Okay. So this is why you have the stars yeah. on the back. I love that. Right. Oh, it looks like the American flag. I just see that, right? Almost. This is why the stars for ah, the American flag neat. are for my favorite uh, bags. Wow. I I've love stars. Got, yeah, stars are great. I've got a lot of favorite bags. But show me, show me. I love I can be here all day. One today. Yes. Please. Show me. Which one? This one. Ooh. Why? This why? Tell me it's beautiful, but tell me why you love it. Because it's different. Mm -hmm. It's a classy one, mm -hmm. but it's a chevron. Mm -hmm. Chevron, I love that. So in chevron we don't see a lot. It's true. This is why I love this one. It is. Um it has a out. very good size. Me, I don't I don't like crossbody bag, mm -hmm. so I prefer to do long strap yeah. uh, uh, on the shoulder. On the shoulder. But I love this one. That one is beautiful. It's beautiful, elegant, casual. Twenty-four karat gold. So Second nice. present. Yes. I prefer vintage one because for me the blazer is better, such a better quality. Better price point. Much better price point. <laughs> Before we leave, Maybe with the bag. Valois. We're going to show her dog. This is her daughter's dog, the owner's. And he's working. He's working on the weekend. <laughs> You're so cute. Thanks for letting me show your shop on my channel. I mean, I know everyone's going to love this shop. You're so wonderful. Thank you so much. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you about having thinking of us. Of course. And trusting us. Absolutely. <laughs> and I hope everybody comes visits your shop. With pleasure. We are here for them. Thank you. <laughs> Au revoir. Au revoir. All right, guys, I'm on the way out. And um, I mean, they just have so many incredible handbags. So definitely a place to come visit when you are in Paris. Look how beautiful it is today in Paris. So I hope you enjoyed this little luxury vintage shopping vlog and I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you're subscribed for more content and if you want shorter videos you can follow me on TikTok or Instagram. It's just DV Double Vanilla and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Bye.